Thank you. Well, city and county governments also bracing for the upcoming storm. West Lafayette Public Works Director Ben Anderson says the wet, heavy snow set to fall on Wednesday is going to be hard to move. He says historically it's taken about eight hours after the last snowflake falls to get the streets cleaned up. And with snow expected for the rest of the work week, it'll be a challenge. He encourages people to not park cars in the street during the storm. West Lafayette has four 14 snow plows. Four of those will be on call throughout the night tonight. We got multiple events coming and we're trying to be a little bit strategic about how we can stay and stay up on being able to keep things things going and, and fighting what weather and mother nature is going to give us. Anderson says West Lafayette has about 250 miles of road to clear. Lafayette has between 500 and 600 and Tippecanoe County has 800 miles. Uh, the city of Lafayette is a step ahead of the incoming storm. Dry weather yesterday and today allowed crews to pre-treat roads with salt water. Employees from several city departments chipped in to help. Dan Kroll with the street department Department says they covered a wide area, including many side streets. Plow drivers will be busy all day tomorrow moving that heavy, wet snow. Coral hopes the briny pretreatment will make those jobs easier. We've been pretreating the roads now for two or three days, and I think we're in pretty good shape. We've got plenty of products, salt to put down. We're ready to go. Crowley is asking drivers to stay at home if possible to allow snowplow drivers to do their jobs. He expects the roads to be clear by late Thursday morning. On the